Some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. In today's video, we find ourselves in Delaware County, New York, with Daniel from Auditing Erie County, as he attempts to audit a courthouse, only to find himself being booted out the door but not before threatening to file uh, frivolous lawsuits on these people. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I'm here today in the county of Delaware, New York, in the town of Delhi, down here before me. First Amendment audit and civil rights investigation. It is a little longer than a few minutes later. So, not I'm, supposed to film in here. Yeah, I'm heading to the clerk's office. Is there a different entrance for that? This is it. Um, what clerk? County hey, clerk. Lieutenant, you want to come down here for a minute? Yeah. Yeah, because we're... Right I'll let you talk to the lieutenant. No, I'm familiar with the court laws. If yeah. I'm where you kind of can't film then. Yes. So, this guy wants to go to the county clerk, but he's got cameras. Well, he got the... Uh, supervisor pretty much right off the bat but unfortunately for him just like in many other situations asking for a supervisor really doesn't help the cause out nor will it help out in this situation as well let's continue on yeah you can't be you can't yeah in the, I mean, he can the take clerk's office clerk, yeah. but he can't, he's running right now so i don't he can't know record out here yeah i can record here yeah you can't record out well here. the new york state court law says that you can't record in a courtroom or the hallway thereof or, or the court offices the court or the hallway thereof. Doesn't and include the hallways, doesn't include the county clerk's office. I'm very familiar with the court laws. It actually does. It's the rules of the chief judge. Yeah, but I'm very familiar. It does not cover this hallway where I'm standing right now. It does it not. Does, so you gotta turn it off. I'm not turning it off. Okay. You know, I'd be willing to bet that Daniel here is uh well lying about what he knows. I mean, he's most likely quote mining. He's most likely cherry picking. I mean, it's been known to happen with all of these dumbass frauditors. They just don't know when to quit lying and cherry picking. So, Daniel, if you really have the truth behind you, why don't you present the, uh, the uh, ruling on the screen? That way we can actually read it. But of course, that is not going to happen you leave, sir. Are you, am i going to get arrested yeah, I, I mean i'll leave under threat of arrest and i'll sue you guys there's no threat of arrest all it's right just well then i'd like to go to the clerk's office no, no, about the camera. Running enough. i've been to every county clerk's office in this county once you get to the state. county clerk you can record all you want but you can't in the court space I won't record on the court space. Right this now. is not a court space. It is a court space. It's not a court it's office. It's court controlled space. It's not a court office. Look at the law. Look okay. at the law. Look at I, the law. I know the law. Well, does it the law does. say court space? It does. It does not. It says any court facility that's signed right on the front door. But, uh, officer, don't you realize that all signs are unconstitutional according to frauditors? Because, well, even if it has a statute on it, or uh, the backing of a judge, it's still unconstitutional, even if, uh, well, it has to be proven in a court that it is unconstitutional. So, yeah, just calling it unconstitutional doesn't make it unconstitutional. It has to be proven in a court of law, dumbass. But it's not the law. It's the, the rules science. of the chief judge. I understand the rules of the chief judge. I'm okay, very, very, very option. familiar. Okay, you need to leave. Okay. I'll leave under threat of arrest. Okay. There's no threat of arrest. All right, I'm, just I'm not leaving. Your I'm not leaving. Okay. Turn your camera off and leave. No. Okay. Well, well then, then if you don't turn I'm, your camera I'm, off it's and leave, very you simple. will be arrested. Well, that's all I need. You can okay. say, I'm going to be arrested, then I will take this up, we'll take it up in court, and I'll sue you guys. Sure. But you sure you want to don't you want to double check on that with some supervisors? Oh, I am a supervisor. So if I don't stop recording right here in this lobby, this of is this building, controlled space. This is, so the law this does is not. The law does not the does not cover the rules court. of the chief judge of New York State. Sorry, officer, but uh, it doesn't matter what the judge says. According to this dumbass right here. It's still unconstitutional, but it's not exactly up to him to determine what's 
constitutional and unconstitutional. I mean, like I said before, that's determined by the courts, but uh, that that's just way over his head, uh, dude, because he's just totally incompetent like that. I understand uh, what the law says. I'm very familiar with it. Okay, and so am I. It does not say the... The rules of the chief judge of New York State says any court facility, the signs on the front door. Okay. Where is it on the front door? Out there on the front door. That's not the law. There's no penal code on it. That's a, that's a sign you guys made up. Okay, that's the, the law sign literally was reads. That was the the sign law was literally reads by the word for word. I'm, reads I'm not going to argue in this court with you anymore. You have two options. They, they, they'll put the ball in your court. You have two options. Turn the camera off and, and do your business in the county clerk office. You can record all you want over there or, to, or leave if you want to still run the camera. The ball's in your court. That's your options. Well, I gotta go to the clerk, county clerk's office, but um, we're definitely gonna take this up with some litigation with the county, sure. honey, guys. So, you know, dude, uh, you really need to keep a low profile, considering that, well, you are on probation for trying to overthrow the government a few years back. So, yeah, uh, you really need to keep a low profile because you'll probably end up doing your, your full term if you get caught doing this kind of bullshit what you feel is necessary. That's, that's your prerogative. Your name is? Lieutenant Mark Fallon, shield number 215. You? Officer Desario, 7704. You? Officer Eckert, 7591. Uh, we'll get to all your names on that litigation. Sure. That's, that's your prerogative. Anybody can sue Well, you're the one upholding the unconstitutional law, number one. You swore I have off. to. I, I swore. It's not what's written on the law. Okay. Well, pull up the law and look at it. I'm not arguing this. Pull up the law and look at it. You know what your options are. Will you pull up the law and look at it? You know what your options are. Will you pull up the law and look at it? You know what your options are. No? All right. Well, it's just documenting it all. I know. Well, I've had enough of this BS because, you know, it's going to be him quote mining and all that other good stuff i mean stuff that frauditors do naturally they take a something out of context or they don't even bother to read it properly or something like that and well it ends up with this kind of nonsense right here him trying to throw his weight around because well he's a moron so at any rate guys i hope you enjoyed the video thanks for watching and i will see you on the next one Dude, so there's no way I can get in, bro? Come on, I'll put you on my YouTube. But shut up, Wesley. You gotta put signs up, ma'am, if it's- Are you Glenn Serio? Who's that?